The history of Kazakh native land is rich. Ancient cities, great men, events and archaic architectural monuments provide evidence for this. Comprehensive history of Kazakh steppe is an object of interest for native land program. Native land. Today in the program. Almaty region, Jambil region. Ancient town of Kastek. Persons realized people's expectations. The southwestern part of Jambil region of Almaty region is covered by the Alatea mountain spurs. In these places there are such jailhouse with juicy grass like Ushkonir, Kumbil, Ulkensas, Maitobe, Karakias, Wiktobe, Konirtobe. And such small and large rivers as Kargali, Uzinagash, Karakistak, Katek, Jirinaigir, Jamanti, Aktirek, Urgaiti add the beauty to the land. This picturesque region is a witness of ancient history. To be more precise, one of the measures to create the first Kazakh Khanate was held between the Chu River and Kuzabasi Mountain, near the village of Targap. At the foot of Anirakai Mountain, a battle took place which turned the beam of the kazakh jungarian War. Several monuments of that time are preserved here, but these as Karasai, Naurizbai, Karash, Saurik, Suranshi, Saribai, Sipatai were born here. There is a mysterious place in Jambul district, Ungirtas. Scientists say that this is the junction of celestial and terrestrial systems. Ungirtas is also called the Holy of Holies of Kazakh land. In March 2000, professor of the Moscow Institute Vyacheslav Bronnikov came here and conducted a research. As a result, it was revealed that a special energy truly rises from the Earth. Jambil region, located in a heavenly corner of Jitisu land, is rich in historical monuments. One of these monuments, widely known not only in our country but also in the countries of the far and near abroad, is the natural boundary of Tamgali. An amazing monument of this place was included in the UNESCO World Heritage List. The number of foreign tourists wishing to see the rock paintings and inscriptions grows annually. I'm, I'm come from Finland, uh, the capital uh, Helsinki. And uh, wh why did I come to Kazakhstan? Uh, there was uh, for, for the summertime there was a direct flight from Helsinki to Astana, so I thought that I would come on my holiday to check out uh, Kazakhstan where I haven't been before. And uh, I'm now uh, traveling these UNESCO sites in, in Kazakhstan because uh, I, I want to see all the UNESCO sites in the world. So. The natural boundary of Tamgali is a centuries-old history that has reached us. In this cultural and historical landscape there are ancient settlements and fortresses dating from the Bronze Age till present days. There are about 100 such archaeological sites. Surprisingly, this region is known not only for the monuments of the Bronze Age, there are various remains of history belonging to the Sakis, the Huns, the early Iron Age and the ancient Turks. Petroglyphs are the most attractive part of all state-protected monuments of the Tamgali Museum Reserve, covering an area of 3,800 hectares. More than 3,000 petroglyphs carved on rocks under the open sky are divided into five groups. Large images, sun-headed deities, Syncretic and zoomorphic images and animals depictions belong to rare petroglyphs, which are nowhere else can be found. In Jambul region, where many historical monuments are hidden, location of a medieval city was discovered. 
It is the site of ancient town of Kastiak. It is located at the foot of Suvik Tobie, is built on the Great Silk Road and refers to the period of Karluk statehood. The ancient name of Kastiak is Karakaman. Back then, the ancient town was one of the political, economic and cultural centers in which caravans used to stop. During archaeological excavations, clay utensils, ironware and pipe remains were found. Researchers have proved that the people living at the foot of the mountains were engaged in melon growing and made wine. Jambul district is the region where famous personalities were born. Here the master of the world was born and grew, the golden pillar of Aitis art who witnessed real but tears in troubled times, a famous Akin singer narrator Suinbaya Ronoli. Competitions of Suinbaya Ronoli with the famous Maili Koja, Tizek Tore and Katagan became bright examples of Aitis art. In the village of Karakistak of Jambil region, there is a literary monument, a museum of talented Akin. This center contains valuable exhibits that tell stories from the life of Suinbai. A talented poet, Jambul Jabayev, who received the blessing of Suinbai Aronoli, considered him a mentor and revered him for the whole life, was buried in Jambul region. In this area named in his honor, there is a museum dedicated to this high personality. In the house museum where Jambul lived, the atmosphere still remains. Each of the 12 rooms of the house museum is full of historical information and artifacts, and every belonging here is a witness of the poet's life. A large number of people who want to get acquainted with the life of legendary Jambul come to these holy places from different parts of our republic and neighboring countries. Near the museum, in the depth of the garden, among the apple trees and pear trees, there is a white marbled gravestone erected in 1946. The great singer was known with his singing talent among the Kazakh and Kyrgyz people already in his 15. His ITIS competitions with such talented Akins as Kulmambet, Dosmaganbet and Aikumis took a worthy place in the Golden Fund of Kazakh Oral Literature. In these parts where Batirs were his writing and Akins presented poems, the national artist of Kazakhstan Aset Besiyev was born. Aset Besiyev was a talented composer who had made a valuable contribution to the development of Kazakh variety music. Till modern days, such songs of composer as My Apple Almaty, The Spring Calls, Do Not Grieve, My Golden Lady, Nightingale, A Wolf's Conversation, My Star, Contemporaries and Cranes Flying from Jaik are in the mouth of the people. In 1951, a cosmonaut Talgat Musabayev was born in Jambul region. He is a pilot cosmonaut of the Republic of Kazakhstan and the Russian Federation, national hero of Kazakhstan, lieutenant general of aviation, master of sports of the USSR in gymnastics and flight sport, USSR champion, doctor of technical sciences, academician of the Kazakhstan National Academy called Ecology. In 1994, since the 1st of June till the 4th of November, Talgat Musabayev has been in space as a flight engineer of the Soyuz TM spaceship and made a spice walk twice. During the flight, he carried out two programs of Kazakhstani scientific research works. In 1998, from the 29th of January till the 25th of August, he took a flight into space as a commander of the spacecraft and the World Orbital Complex. This time he made five spice walks. The 
the childhood and youth of Talgat Musabayev's contemporary, the first Kazakh Olympic champion Jaksali Kushkimpirov has also passed in Jambel region. The best world wrestler was fond of the Kazakh wrestling in his childhood and began to engage in classical and freestyle wrestling when he entered the institute. Having won equal opponents in various international tournaments at the Olympics in 1980s, he went on the carpet in the weight category of up to 48 kilograms. He is the only Kazakh who, with his quickness, endurance and excellent technique, has twice won the world champion Alexander and other famous wrestlers. He is the champion who survived many difficulties on the way to victory, created all the conditions for the development and training of the younger generation interested in wrestling in his native village. Since you began to engage in wrestling, you must become real masters of this sport. This is a sports complex which I built in the village of Munbayev. I built it for you at my own expenses. Tomorrow you have to become world champions and Olympic champions as I am. What wonderful conditions are created for you. There were no such agility mats in my time. When I was a child, they were mattresses, we covered them with blankets and fought on them. But you are a happy generation, that's what it means, an independent state, a sovereign country. That's why you are a happy generation, so many fans are cheering up for you. You will become those who will raise the flag of Kazakhstan and show the whole world what kind of people we are, what country we have and why we are better than other countries. Therefore, I wish you health. Jaksalik Kushkimpirov made a lot of good for his village. In addition to the sports complex, he built a school and a kindergarten, provided the locals with work. Now I'm building a community center for people may dance and sing songs there. We have to organize everything. This should be a place where young children will go. We must create conditions for them. If I do not do this, if someone else does not do it, then who will? In the end, we ourselves must do everything. So we must act, we must support the youth. And then we can say, I've created conditions for you, now you work. Why cannot you? You are much younger than me. I am now almost 70 years old, and if I were young, I would have done everything the same. We should be like that. We should be patriots for the sake of our homeland. Azerbaijani writer, philosopher Mirzafa Talia Hundev said, A patriot is a person who spares no effort not excluding the life on the way to glorifying his motherland. And Jaksalikush Kimpirov is a citizen who did a lot for his native village and his homeland. Of course, in the end, wherever we are, our feelings to the people and to the motherland remain here in our hearts. I am happy that I was born a Kazakh. Everyone must work for his nation, only then we will become a strong state. That's why we must love our nation, our people. Jambul region is the land of famous personalities who love their people and whom the people loved. Their life paths full of teachings are an example for the younger generation, and valuable monuments of this region are witnesses of our eternal history carved on the rocks.